Not long ago I tested one of the first prototypes of Boya BYWM8. It is a wireless microphone system and uh, results were good. The only negative thing I found was a tiny clipping during recording. The level of clipping was acceptable, but nevertheless I did share results of my tests with Boya people. And I was surprised, because soon they replied and offered me a new version of this system, I would say, advanced version of this system. So today I'd like to show you results of my new tests. I don't want to waste your time by repeating introduction, get started, etc. You can watch it at the end of this review. Let's open the case, load the batteries, connect microphones, leads, and let's start with some tests. I started my tests in studio full of lights, cables, there are some transmitters around, therefore I selected most clean channel for this test. Camera preamplifiers, usually a bit more noisy, and uh, I decided to make test uh, with kind of in, in more pure circumstances, I did connect a receiver, Boya receiver, to recorder Zoom H6. Both transmitters got level 24, receiver on the maximum, and uh, we kind of have pure sound now. I also switched the field monitor, which makes some noises here in this room. So you can hear silence and more pure white noise. Volume level 26 on both, and receiver connected to Panasonic 171. The receiver is set to mono mode. You possibly can hear a sound of monitor, field monitor, ventilator, which is 5 meters next to me. Peter Piper, the pickled pepper picker, picked a pack of pickled pepper. If Peter Piper, the pickled pepper picker, picked a pack of pickled pepper, how many pickled peppers did Peter Piper, the pickled pepper picker, pick? Both receivers are connected to Panasonic 250, and uh, each system connected to its own XLR channel. Now, Sennheiser is on, and Boy is on mute mode, and now you can hear sound from Sennheiser system. And you remember, I use microphone ME, yes, yeah, Sennheiser ME2. Check one, two, check one, two, check one, two. We're coming back to Boy. Now Boy is on, check one, two, check one, two, check one, two, one, two, three. One boy transmitter and uh, it's connected to one XLR of Panasonic 250. Check one, two, check one, two, check one, two. I can speak closer. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Two boy transmitters, both are on and I have two lavalier microphones on me from Boya. Check one, two. Check one, two, check one, two. Test of two uh, different microphones connected to transmitters. One of them is Sennheiser ME2. Another is Boy Kit Mic. So there are two lavaliers connected to the uh, transmitters and I have receiver on mono mode. Attenuation level is 20 on all systems, uh, transmitters and receiver. Panasonic GH2 is set to recording level 1. I will switch off Sennheiser first and you will hear sound only from Boya kit mic. Now you can hear sound only from Boya kit microphone 
and uh, I just want you to hear the the sense, the how it sounds. Check one two, check one two, boy, kit, mic, boy, lavalier. Now I will jump to the Sennheiser ME2. Boy is mute, Sennheiser is on. Check one two, 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 check one two. Again, we have Sennheiser, and we jump back to the boy. Boy is on. Check one two, check one two, check one two. Sennheiser is mute. Check one two, check one two, check one two. Boy, kit, mic. Check one two, check one two, check one two. Now we will shift to Sennheiser. Boom. Now you can hear sound from Sennheiser ME2 connected to Boyer transmitter. Check one two, 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 and we jump back to Boyer. Now sound coming from Boyer. It is Boyer kit mic. All in all, my feeling about this new version of Boyer BYWM8 is very positive. Very positive. First of all, clipping level is much lower. One more thing, this system is very simple in use. If you want to make step forward and if you have extra budget, you always can attach more advanced microphones to this system. Uh, another thing, always check the legal frequency for your area, because if you use illegal frequency then you will have distortions and more you can have uh, troubles with authorities so check the list of legal frequencies for your area there are two microphones lavalier microphones with uh, solid clamps and with a sennheiser type thumb screw and you have two leads one is mini jack to xlr Another lead, also with some screw, is the mini jack to mini jack. There are two mounts and there are belt clips here. Uh, you have uh, two AA type batteries for each uh, unit. You have power button. When you press and hold it, long so display will lead and you will have all your information here you have mic uh, connector here and you can screw your lavalier mic here and you have possibility to take signal from for example mixer there is a line in connector so you can take one of your leads and you can record signal for example from sound mixer the blue LED indicate that your batteries are OK, system turned on, but when LED turns red, so there is a time to change batteries. Middle button here, it's called set. You can go from channel selection to volume selection and back. System got 48 channels, so you always can find most clean, most, most pure sound and uh, avoid distortions. Then you press it once again, you go to volume and you have possibility to select one of the 32 attenuation or volume levels. You have also indication of the battery here. And one more thing, when you press power button short, you can see you have your system mute. It doesn't send a signal. Good, let's switch it off and let's go to, to receiver. You can use line connector, XLR or mini jack and you have to connect your system to recorder or to camera. You can also connect your earphones here. It's a great possibility for monitoring. And then you have to turn system on. It is simple like this. So your display is lit now and you can see channel and battery state level. More, you, you can see the green LED here. It shows that your system is on. When this LED turns red, it indicates there is a time to change battery. Set button. 
you go from different sets. You can now set up the channel, volume and stereo mono. Set again, you're coming back to channel. You have 48 channel to select. So always find the best channel you love, most pure. Volume. You have 32 volume levels. And again, stereo mono. You can use mono, you can use stereo. When you turn your transmitter, you can see the LED is lit. And it shows that transmitter is in touch, it is on. When you stand behind the camera, you can always see that transmitter is okay, you have connection and your battery is okay. That's the basic thing about the system. I hope my test will help you to understand what is new version of the Boyer wireless system and I hope you will make good decision for your projects. Thank you for attention.